guys second video of the day second and last i have to say and then i'll be doing some editing and chilling out and trying to relax um but i actually went on the lara dute sale and this is my haul my name's fawn this is my channel and it's my happy place i come on here and i talk to my friends it's never a pain really because i just know that you guys are going to be straight and honest and open with me um and you've all been so patient while i've been poorly so you know you're getting a lot now <laughs> um but if you like that kind of thing please do give me a thumbs up click subscribe and leave a comment I can see this is going to be one of those chatty videos, guys. <laughs> I'm constantly getting on Facebook and various places ads from Lara Dute. And I haven't used Lara Dute for a long, long time. You know, they're a catalogue company. They do odd sizing. I think the last time I used it, I was buying some baby clothes for my eldest grandson because they had a really good Winnie the Pooh range and he wanted, or his mum, wanted Winnie the Pooh for him. So I mean that's going back almost five years. Anyway I clicked the link and I found some things and I'm going to try them. This was the dress that made me click the link in the sale. It's cotton, it's red, you know I'm constantly searching for it. I'm always trying red dresses and I almost never keep them. Um, I'm trying to think. Yeah, no, I really almost never keep them. So anyway, I saw this one and liked it. I liked the floral pattern. It does have long sleeves, not a favourite, but it does have tab sleeves, so it can be worn rolled up. It is a shirt dress. It's cotton. It has pockets. And the even more exciting thing is it was £58, but it was £27 in the sale. Don't know if I'd have paid £58, but £27, I'm really pleased. Let's hope it fits. I love denim dresses. Holding my hand up, I do, I love them. But I don't like the really fitted ones because denim's sort of quite stiff. This is cotton denim, so it's much lighter weight. V-neck, well, it's got a collar, you know? It's an open neck, like a shirt. Short sleeves. It's got a really pretty kind of flary skirt. It does have pockets. It has poppers, which worries me slightly. I hope they're strong poppers with what goes on when I'm walking around and my body's jiveling. But it was £58. And in the sale, it was £23.20. Another dress. Goodness me. But it's a navy jersey dress. Really, really simple. You know I've been hunting for a nice navy or dark blue jersey. Just a simple, simple dress. And I've not been able to find one that wasn't hideously expensive. Well, this one, I think, looks really pretty. It has a V-neck. It has some pleating detail. It has a defined waist with a belt. It has a full skirt. It doesn't have pockets, but then I can't have everything, can I? <laughs> this was £45 and I paid £22.50. Next is a really pretty cotton tunic blouse. Look at this colour. Isn't that lovely? It's a really nice shade of yellow. It's not an in-your-face. It's slightly mustardy, slightly ochre. Again, it has roll tab sleeves if you want them, or long. It is properly long, as a tunic should be. And it has little ties, so you can bring it in a little bit of the waist should you wish to. I think it's lovely. It was £45 down to £18. And the last thing I bought will either look great or will look like something my granny would wear. They're trousers. These trousers. Check trousers with a really big turn up on them. <laughs> they were £68 and down to £27.20. So it's you know, still quite expensive. £27.20 for a pair of trousers. I'm still thinking about it. But possibly they're going to look amazing on. I have hopes, and at the same time, I have a hell of a lot of fears, but I do think these would look great going through into the winter. So, yeah, that was my Lara Duke haul. I haven't, as I said, I haven't done that Lara Duke for years and years. The things have come. I've liked the fabrics. They've been packaged beautifully. And in the sale, I love the prices. <laughs> Out of the sale, not sure, not sure. But in the sale, yay, I will be going on Lara Dute again. But let's go and try them on. As I was wearing my jeans anyway, I thought I'd start with the top and I flat out love it. Full sleeve, it's not 
right down to my wrist. So I'm quite happy with it like that, but I can also turn it up because it has the buttons on it. I think the length on this is fabulous. I've got it on with my jeans, as I said, because I was wearing jeans, but this would go really well with leggings because look at the coverage on this. Look at the coverage, ladies. There's nothing to worry about. And I think the color is great. It feels nice. I might have pulled the ribbon a bit too, the, the belt a bit too tight. Let me just slacken it off a bit. It always takes a while to figure that out, doesn't it? And <laughs> tying a bow behind my back as well. Um, the fit on it is great. I feel great in this. This is perfect for me, really. So um, that's one right for Larry Dukes. Okay, here's the trousers. Now, as you can see, they're slightly cropped. They're sort of, my daughter calls them ankle bashers. Um, they are slightly cropped. They're meant to be. It's not that they're too short for me. I really enjoy, I'm enjoying the big turn up on the bottom. I think that's cute. I think I'm dressed completely wrong with this. I think it needs a dark chocolatey brown or even a black top rather than a yellow. This was just, it came to hand, do you know what I mean? Um, and obviously not sandals, I think boots would look, or you know, some of those shoe boots, you know the sort? I think they'd look good. I like them. These are very, very comfortable. Obviously, that's always with the caveat that when I look at it on video, I might change my mind, and you guys might change my mind, but I think they're nice. Um, I think they fit really nicely over the bum. They feel kind of, kind of elegant, but easy. They do feel easy. I'm in a nice cream shirt with it might look pretty stylish too. So, um, I'm pleased with these as well. It's taken me all summer, ladies, but I think I finally found a navy t-shirt, jersey, fabric, dress, that A, I think is worth the money, and B, I think looks nice. The only thing that's missing is pockets, and then it would be like a dream come true, but it's still hitting so many of the pluses that, I can't imagine a reason why I would send it back. I can't imagine what I could see on there that would change my mind about it. I like the full skirt. I think that's cute. Um, the belt is okay. I'm not a great lover of belts on these dresses, but you know, the V-neck could be lower. Maybe that would, I would change that. But I think it's kind of elegant being that height. I like the little sleeves. Um, I really do feel nice in this dress. Let me come in so you can see the details on the bodice. Um, there's lots of sort of pleating going on, pleating under, so that it, it you know, it's gentle. Um, you don't feel, or I don't feel, boobilicious in it. I just feel, well, this is an easy me. Put this on with flip-flops and I'm, you know, <laughs> onto the dress that started the haul. It's lovely, it's cotton. Um, I can breathe. I like the pockets, you know me, loving a pocket. Um, I like the fact that it's a shirt dress so I can wear it open. It is slightly pulling here. I have one of my tattiest, oldest bras on because it's the softest on this particular wound, which is still there. It is closed over, but I just don't want to aggravate it. So this is just a very comfy bra, whereas a normal bra would lift me a little bit more. <laughs> um, and I think that would alleviate this issue. Um, this is it long sleeved. I wouldn't wear it long sleeved. Um, I start to feel suffocated the minute I, I've got too many layers on, but I can roll it up. Whoops, let's do one. Um, it's a shame that, you know, because you get the, the contrast, but for me, it's all about breathability. And I'll just, hmm, here I'm being so efficient trying to do this up now. <laughs> there we go. Um, and you can just roll the sleeves up. I think it's great. Again, I think it's another very, very easy wear dress. There's lots of room in it. I meant to say to you, because this is Lara Dut, I've been buying, I was buying a size 20. These have all been a size 20 Lara Dut. So, um, you know, possibly that's probably why there's a tiny bit of a pull here. Um, but if I push my boobs together, as you can see, it disappears. <laughs> <laughs> I just have to be careful what bra I wear and maybe lose a pound or two off this big fat back of mine. <laughs> but yeah, it's red, it's cotton, it's got pockets. What's not to love? And here we go with the denim. I love it. It has its pockets. 
I like the flared skirt on it. You know that's a preference of mine. Um, I just think when you're when you're plumptious, it's kinder. Um, I would probably possibly change the belt out for a proper belt. I'm not a great lover of these things that you tie up. Um, it has poppers. It has pockets on the boobs as well. <laughs> I'm wearing it quite open, but I could pop it up. But unfortunately, it really needs a popper there. They've put the poppers quite far apart. Um, you know, your choice of popper. They're quite far apart, so I might put a modesty stitch in just there because I am worried that you might can see. I don't know. Can you see inside to my bra? I don't really know. But I love it. So that was my first Lara Dute haul in like forever. And I don't know, I think it might even be my first one ever for me. And I love it all. I love it all. I'm worried that that might be a bit too. Mm, you girls are gonna have to let me know. But again, it's the same issue. When my boobs are where they're meant to be. <laughs> Can you see the difference? Look, that's where it's meant to be. That's where it is. <laughs> Because this bra has just seen such better days. I've had it for donkey's years, but it is so soft. Um, and my last wound, can you see, is here. I'm trying to be modest. I'm sure I show more in a bikini. So there's my last wound. So I'm, I'm not my last wound. That's the wound that's causing the trouble. Um, but there is plenty of space in this dress. Um, I love it. I love everything. I don't think there's anything going back for the Lara Duke. It all has a place and a job and a role in my wardrobe. Of course, I might watch the video and think, oh, what was it looking at? And of course you might say, Fawn, what the who hecky were you doing? But at the moment, I feel great. <laughs> Have a look at Lara Du at the sale. Take some chances, lady, send for some things. They're not bad to send back to. I have sent back to when I was ordering things for my and my grandson. Um, you know, they're, they're just like any of the other catalogue companies. I still think of it as a catalogue company. Um, but as you can see, over this last week, I've done quite a lot of videos of clothing. I'm trying to push my boundaries and find some things and some of them work. I'm sure that's gaping a little bit. I can't quite tell. <laughs> anyway. I hope you have some success and find some things you really, really like, especially in sales. All right, I'll see you soon. Bye, guys.